from last night we're ready to learn. Good to go? Okay, I'm gonna take a selfie real quick so my mom knows that this is real. So get excited, ready? Woo! Ooh. Bam, awesome. My mom will love that. Okay, uh, thanks everyone for uh, showing up here today. Again, my name is John Fry, and uh, as I said, I've uh, kind of been dabbling in growth hacking, did the start of you thing, so I'm here to tell you what I did to my personal brands uh, in terms of Twitter. Boom. So uh, if you want to look at my Twitter right now, just search on Twitter, that name right there, John Fry. It'll pop up. It's, it's verified, uh, so you know it's real. Um, and like I said, I actually have about a little over 38,000 followers right now. You can just see real time the engagement, what's going on, and uh, you know if it's legit or not, which, which it is. Um, so the first question, what the fuck is growth hacking? Um, this term gets thrown around all the time. It's a really uh, buzzy buzzword, like, like hustle or whatever. So I, I just like to explain things. Um, like to a, like a toddler, to like a four-year-old. Uh, so for me, what growth hacking is, is getting a lot of attention with as little resources, time, money as possible, right? You wanna grow your business, you wanna grow your personal brand, uh, but you don't have a lot of time and money as a, as a founder, as a startup employee, whatever. Um, so to me, that's what growth hacking is, and that's what the mindset I use when I look at different social channels like Twitter. So why Twitter? This is another big question. There's a big debate right now, like is Twitter gonna stick around for the next five, 10 years? Uh, is it useful? Why should I be investing time in that one? There's like Instagram and Snapchat, and, and basically right now there's this, this window of time. It's not that it's dead, it's not MySpace, but it's still pretty good. Like people are engaging, uh, you know, every time Kanye tweets, it's like, you know, there's a, a trillion stories about it. Um, people are still asking celebrities questions. Uh, so it's still a good time to build your brand there. And it's very, very growth hackable. And what I mean by that is Cliff mentioned those limits earlier. They're much tighter on Instagram. They're much tighter on all these other social platforms. But with Twitter, they're really, they're really pretty relaxed. Um, this is a very little known fact. But if you're ever working with a client with a um, verified account, you can follow and unfollow simultaneously 10,000 people a day. So that's really good. You'll, you'll probably see some of these like bigger verified accounts. That's how they're getting that insane growth. And they're you know they're following 300,000, but half a million followers. They're literally following 10,000 and unfollowing 10,000 people every single day. Okay. So I want to get straight to the meat. We'll go into Q and A, and I'll get more in depth. Uh, but this is like the tip of the iceberg here. What's the secret? So for Instagram, uh, it was Instagram, right? There's a bunch of other tools uh, that you can use with Twitter, but for me. This is the thing that gets the job done. Mass Planner. MassPlanner.com, go check it out. Buy it if you want. It's insanely powerful. It's the only social automation tool that I've found that will consistently deliver pretty much exactly the results you put in. A lot of other ones are kind of buggy. Um, you don't know exactly what to expect. But Mass Planner is really strong. It's not a cloud-based software, which means it literally runs on your computer. Um, the, the biggest, there's several downsides, but the biggest downside is it's PC only. So you might have to get a virtual PC, but I just kind of wanted to quickly talk about how Master Planner works. Um, so you can add several profiles. Twitter is the one that it works best for, which is again why I use it um, for that. It's pretty simple, you just log in your Twitter account, that creates a profile. And uh, again, I said it wasn't super simple. This is how it's done. So you, you can say like, okay, you know, wait between you know, 30 and 60 minutes, follow between this many people. Um, and basically, if you just work out this math, you'll see, okay, I can follow, by the way, unverified accounts can follow up to 1,000 people a day, so uh, for your accounts. Um, this is how I get my Twitter following uh, up so high, uh, is with this. It's gonna take time, um, it's, it's not, again, super user friendly, um, but if you just sit down for an hour with this, maybe look at some of the resources that MassivePlanner.com has, it's really gonna work. I promise this is the strongest application I've found and I've looked at script. I used to use like a script where you put in like, you know, you literally manually typing the name and like all this like crazy hacker shit. This is still simple and it's mad powerful. Um, so the bigger question is, how does this help my brand? How does this help my business? Well, um, two of the biggest things. One, you get leads. Every single new follower is a potential lead. Now, of course, you can automate like with auto messages and whatever, but what I like to do 
is I go through uh, my followers and I will manually see like, okay, this person has like a beauty business, this person has a startup. And then I can reach out to them and say, hey, just saw your website, uh, looks like you're doing some awesome things, uh, but I wanted to kind of help out, you know, maybe we can jump on a call and I can, we can just brainstorm and just give them as much value and, and free stuff as possible and then maybe they'll become a customer. Second thing is reputation. Like Cliff said earlier, you look at an account, it has a bunch of followers, you're like, okay, like, these people must be, must be legit, this person must be legit. Um, it helps your ranking in uh, Google if your Twitter profile is really, uh, really strong. There's just so many things to be said about having a lot of followers in terms of the reputation, your reputation, the way that people um, view your brand. And uh, as kind of a closing note, if you want to go deeper, I like the depth. Um, feel free to just shoot me an email anytime. Um, we'll hop on a call. I'll look at your brand and see, like, okay, like, uh, you know, maybe even beyond Mass Planner, maybe in content, maybe in other social channels. You know, what should you be doing? Happy to do that. So, with that being said, I'd love to open it up for some Q and A. Don't be afraid to go deep uh, if you have any specific questions. The floor is yours.